what am I doing? I'm dancing to the music on my CD. Unfortunately, it's all copyrighted, so I've had to mute it. Good afternoon, guys. How are you all doing? I know, I know. I'm daft. <laughs> Honestly, though, it is copyright, so I can't really play it. But anyway, I have come to town. I thought I want to go shopping, but I'm like, shall I go to work? So, Barnsley? And I'm like, no, I want to go to town. So, that's where I've come to. I've only got like three hours here. That's how much I've got for my parking. So, I'm just going to head to the usual places you know hmv cex and all that but before i go that way i'm trying to think what i've been up to i've had a doctor my doctor called me to let me know about the x-ray results apparently they can't find anything wrong but the thing is the pain's lessened so we're thinking maybe it'll heal in time i don't know but he's going to ring me up again in another few weeks to see how i am so we'll find out then um what else have i been up to not a lot oh i can tell you one thing i tried turning my xbox one on yesterday and it wouldn't work i don't know why it was fine the day before so that's kaput by the look of things maybe it's time to get a, a, a new xbox <laughs> I don't know. I've I've not thought about it that much. I'll either get it repaired or I'll just buy a new one, I don't know. And it's funny because two days before I finally opened up Watch Dogs 2, which I bought 22 months ago. That's how long it's been sat on the shelf waiting for me to play it. And I started it and now I can't play it. <laughs> Maybe it died of shock. <laughs> oh dear. You know, it's like Wow, you've put this game in finally! <laughs> but anyway, I can't remember if there's anything else I've done. Not a lot, really. Anyway, I'm gonna uh, get out of this very warm car. I'm gonna head over to where HMV is. I'm not expecting to buy any DVDs, but I'm gonna have a look anyway. Well, I've been in three shops, and so far I've bought nothing. I went in CEX first. And the prices on some of the things that I wanted were just too pricey. I then went into trade to us. I did see something I like the look of, but I think I can get it cheaper at a later date, so I left it. And I've just been in Sports Direct, and nothing really took my fancy. Apart from a pair of shorts, except <laughs> I put them against my legs and they went below my knees. I'm like, oh, come on. I liked them as well. Oh, well. Right. I'm going to try my luck in HMV now. I don't know what's going on. I've been to HMV, I've walked all the way through town, and now I'm at the bottom of the mall, and I've bought nothing. I seem to have this sudden inability to shop. I don't know why. Although, this charity shop I've just been in, I almost bought a book, because they got one that I'm after. However, when I picked it up, it was all sticky, and I'm like, nope, put that back. I mean, it's not a total waste of time. I'm going to go to the comic shop now. I'll buy something from there, get my comic books. But yeah, everywhere I've gone. It doesn't help that between the Moor and Fargate, they're doing a lot of building work, so there's no shops there. They're all gone. And there used to be charity shops there, at least two. So, anyway, I mean, I could... Hmm, just thinking, maybe I should pop to Decathlon. Because I've been looking at shirts, even in the charity shops. I've got time. I'm going to go to Decathlon. I take it back. I can shop. As soon as I walked in, I saw some shirts. Check it out. Oh, I like them. Got a zip pocket here. Secure pocket there and there. And two on the bike. I know these aren't, but that's fine. And I'm going to try this pair on as well but they're the exact same so can't believe it <laughs> just gonna try them on first though and there's a second pair on look at that i like not below the knees it's great the only thing is these this belt on both of them is way too long but it's fine i can put another belt on 
I really like them. So finally I'm buying something. <laughs> <laughs> the best thing is I'll be able to put my camera pouch on the belt on these. Awesome. Right, I'm gonna go pay for them and then head to the comic shop. Wow, it's warm in this car. That's why I've got the door open to let some air in. I know, I know, I could wind the windows down, but that means turning the car on. I've been to the comic shop, got my books, and now I'm gonna head on home. And it's currently half past four, so that means I'm gonna have to deal with rush hour traffic. Yeesh. I'm actually contemplating putting one of those pairs of shorts on because it is very warm. It's overcast, but like I say, warm. The sun has been coming out every now and then, which is why this car is warm. Maybe I should turn the aircon on. <laughs> oh well, I'm done with shopping now. Time to go home. As you can see, I'm home now. I've just walked Harley. He's now upstairs eating his dinner. I'm about to put mine on because I'm very, very hungry. But first, Enjoy your dinner, yeah? Did you eat it all? Yeah? Good boy, good boy. <laughs> I always say that to him. Right, let's turn this TV on and try turning my Xbox on. Where? Oh, it's there. I was wondering what I did with my controller. See, yesterday when it was doing it, I texted my brother to see if, you know, there was anything wrong with Xbox Live or anything. He said no. So he gave me a few suggestions and one of them was to hold the eject button at the same time as the power button for 10 seconds and it would start up in low resolution mode. And it's started doing that. In fact, let me show you. Okay, so I've turned it on. So it brings this up. As you can see, it's in low res. And every time I tried it yesterday, it just kept going blank straight afterwards. Any second now. Oh, there we go. Gone blank. And that's it. That's all it does. Not a clue as to why. There was no warning signs the day before. It was fine. I've been watching Disney Plus on there. And then later on I was watching some YouTube. And it's just doing this blank. So I might have to go and try and get it repaired. But if it's going to cost more than an Xbox itself, I might as well just buy a new Xbox. <sighs> Which is a shame because I've got a lot of games saved on there that I've yet to try, that I downloaded. Plus all my save progress on Fallout 4 and all the other games. Mind you, I was going to plan on starting Fallout 4 again at some point. I keep saying that and I still haven't done it. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to sign off now so I can have something to eat. And I just thought, I want to watch 911 and... 911 Lone Star through Now TV, but I usually watch through my Xbox. So I'm gonna have to connect my laptop to the television. <sighs> ay, 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 problems, but whatever. Is there anything else before I go? Mm, I don't think so. But knowing me, I'll remember after I finish. It tends to happen a lot, that. <laughs> All that's left for me to say is thank you for watching and subscribing if you have. I almost forgot it because it's been that long. <laughs> Until the next time, peace out. You know, I have a theory as to why my Xbox One won't switch on. The Cyber Ghost is at it again. Leave my electronics alone. <sighs>